Hide My Email is another really nice privacy feature that comes with an iCloud Plus membership. It lets us create and use randomized iCloud email addresses rather than our dedicated iCloud email address. So for this account, my email address is themacu at me.com. Themacu at iCloud.com will also work interchangeably. From here in iCloud settings, if I go into hide my email, notice that we're able to manually create a new address. These are going to be randomly chosen and they can't be edited. If you don't want to use the one that gets presented, tap use different address to create a new one. And we can add a label and enter a note for this address to help keep track of what it might be used for. I'm just going to call this one test and I'll leave the note section empty. So that new iCloud email address is now active and it's automatically going to forward email sent to it to my true iCloud email address. This will allow me to give this address to a person or business rather than my real email address. So let's test it out. From here on the Mac, I'm going to send an email to the random address from a Gmail account. The email arrives here on my iPhone. Notice in the To field, this says Hide My Email. Tap and we're able to see the address that the sender used. This is the only address that the sender ever saw. If I head back to Hide My Email Settings and tap on that address, notice that it can be deactivated. Doing this would prevent any sender that has this address from successfully sending me any email again. That's just one way to use Hide My Email. You will probably more often use this when an email is requested from a website. Here in Safari, I'm about to sign up for the newsletter from this website. Tap on the email field, and again, we can enter my actual iCloud email address or use Hide My Email. This will generate another separate new iCloud address that will be given to this website to deliver their newsletters to. Again, I can enter a label and a note in order to be able to refer to what this address is being used for. Tap Use, and then I can submit the address to the site. In Hide My Email settings, there are now two random addresses. The one I added on my own, and this new one that's being used to receive newsletters from thespruce.com. What often happens when we submit an email to a website or into an app is the email is passed out to other marketers aside from the website that we submitted it to, which results in more and more email spam. With the Hide My Email solution, we're able to simply deactivate the Hide My Email address to stop receiving all email to it. We can see deactivated addresses are saved down here. Utilizing these randomized addresses rather than the email address directly associated with your iCloud account will not only cut down on junk email, but it will also allow us to see which of the randomized addresses are being spammed. Knowing that will inform us as to what websites, apps, or individuals have passed those addresses onto other email marketers. So Hide My Email is a really good new feature for iCloud Plus users.